I am the Chronicler. I shall record your adventures in my book of legends. Tell me of your deeds. Alright, welcome back. Let's play some more silver, shall we? We've been having pretty fun with this game. This stuff reminds me of the old school days. Oh, that's cool. Uh oh. Ambush. Tell me of your deeds. Tell me of your deeds. <laughs> Which way shall we go? Oh, my God. 
Point it over there and he runs over there and starts attacking.
Under product alert. Ooh, ooh. What's that? A bronze key. Staff lightning? Oh, yeah. What's that? Money? Oh, 100 gold. 100 gold. You two are useless. Mm. I guess I need to. I guess I need to. Um. I guess I need to pick in some special moves. Let's have to cleave. Uh, actually, I'm useless, so I, I should. Hmm. Let's see what the cleave looks like. Your adventures have been many. I will record them in my book, so that you may know them always. You may know them always. <laughs> Guess that was it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> no, no, it was not a hard fight, just figuring out what to do. Oh. Ooh, look at this. If your path takes you to the monastery, turn back. You'll find nothing there but an asylum of psychotic madmen. And the monks? 
They are all demented. Our water supply was poisoned. By silver? That's my belief. Hmm. We wouldn't bow down and renounce our ideology. We are strong, virtuous people, and he's punished us by stealing our peace and damning us to a life of anguish. Hmm. You say we. Have you been affected by the poison? No. I was in rain during the infection and was spared the madness. But while my brothers suffer, I suffer. Rest assured, silver will pay. But you can't live in the monastery without water. Where will you go? If your mission challenges silver, then my place is with you. Okay. I am strong and proficient in the more traditional fighting arts. I would be a loyal ally. Okay. Let's get rid of that. We would be honored. But first, how do we address you? By my given name, Kagan. Vivian, go to the rebel camp in Haven and check if we've had word from the Duke. Wait there and rest until we need you. Alright. That's pretty cool. Hit points, bro. You got a lot of hit points. You got a lot of mana, too. You got more than I got. Oh, he got 647. I got 554. You got more mana. Okay. That's, um. Let's equip him with magic. Let's equip him with power bomb. He's got a crap load of uh, mana. He runs off. Okay. Shut 
little game, bro. This reminds me of the old Commodore 64 days, but just better graphics. Ooh. Oh, oh, what is that? I right, that's a bunch of them. We're going to push the magic. Hmm. Of my damn man, bro. Look at this bullshit. Get out the way. I 
like this little game, but the controls are god awful hard. Mm-hmm. Retarded, man. <sighs> Across from the little bridge. Do, 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 do. Reaper. Hmm. <laughs> That's so cool. Even it's got the little grip bit from the magic. That's awesome. <laughs> That's very cool. Uh-oh. Okay. You need me to do something. Ooh. Um, he appears to be unaffected by the poison. Could meditation counter its effect? It's more likely that he's remained in a trance throughout and hasn't drunk the infected water. Do you think he can hear us? If he chooses to. <clears throat> I don't mean to disturb you. But human nature is prone to inquisitiveness, I understand. And no, I didn't drink the water. But unfortunately, I'm the only one here who didn't. Hmm. You must leave the monastery. You won't survive long without water. I won't leave. I stay until the poison dissipates and the font is purified. Meditation will preserve me. Is there nothing we can do to change your mind? No, but it would help my concentration if you could find me one of life's great questions to ponder. I will reward your labor well. We'll do what we can. Thank you. But now, I must return to my trance. What a life great question. Alright, that's pretty funny. Ah, what came first? Chicken or egg? Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Hmm. These chests, man. I can't get them. I need, I need some amulet of sin or some shit. <sighs> I think every location has one of these, one of these secret chests. to the barracks earlier and uh, resupplied. That's where you can go back and buy arrows and all that is the barracks. So soon. Sorry. Do you want it? Back for more! Not 
give me a couple of arrows. Under five of them you have, okay. He obviously a priest. Right, right. <clears throat> This is such a cool little game. Alright, so let's, uh, let's go to the library and see if, uh, see if they know anything about the life's question. Because they had the guy that was like, give a hint there, like, uh, why these guys give us a hint? Yeah. Oh, hello! You will have to forgive my excitement, but, uh... Ah, uh, he's just reasoned out one of life's great questions. Oh. Yes, thank you, Professor. Yeah, you should take it. Such thought-provoking philosophies are inspiring. It may help you on your quest. Thank you. I'm sure it will. I should have right scroll. Alright, let's go back to him and give him a scroll and see what happens. Uh... Can I get to the cave? The monastery? I guess I can't, I guess. <clears throat> oh, I guess. I can't go directly to the cave. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it's gonna make me go all that way. That sucks. We have a scroll that details a life question for you to ponder. Thank you. I'm sure I'll find this most engaging. In return, take this ethereal potion. It will transport you to a different place in time and will answer questions you don't yet know to ask. Okay. Oh. What's going on? Oh, I got main control of my guy, okay. There's a key there. Oh. What happened? I was transported to a gallery where Reuben was exhibiting his paintings. Then Silver walked in. 
It was horrific. Reuben's boots and this key were all that were left. Hmm. Save it. Tell me of your deeds, adventurer, so that I may record them in my book of legends. Pretty cool. You're, you're a good place to start. What a great game. What a great little game this is. I did not finish this back in the day. I played I played for a little while, but I didn't understand the comeback. But doing better now. 